The Manila Times is the oldest existing English language newspaper in the Philippines. It is published daily by the Manila Times Publishing Corp., with editorial and administrative offices at 2 F. Sitio Grande Building, 409 A. Soriano Avenue, Intramuros, Manila. It was founded on October 11, 1898, shortly after news that the Treaty of Paris would be signed, ending the Spanish-American War and transferring the Philippines from Spanish to American sovereignty. It presently bills itself as having the fourth largest circulation of the newspapers in the Philippines, beating the Manila Standard, but still behind the Philippine Daily Inquirer, the Manila Bulletin and the Philippine Star. The current President and Chief Executive Officer CEO, and Executive Editor is Dante Francis. Clink. Ang Tu. On May 1, 2017, its Chairman Emeritus Dante Arevalo Ang was appointed by Philippine President Rodrigo Roa Duterte as Special Envoy of the President for International Public Relations. History the Manila Times was founded by Thomas Gowan, an Englishman who had been living in the Philippines. The paper was created to serve mainly the Americans who were sent to Manila to fight in the Spanish-American War. At the time, most of the newspapers in the Philippines were in Spanish and a few others were in the native languages. Shortly after the paper's founding, reports reached Manila about the Paris Conference that would lead to the treaty ceding the Philippines to the United States from Spain. The maiden issue of the Manila Times had a sheet of two leaves, or four pages, measuring about 12 by 8 inches, each page divided into two columns. The first page was taken up by announcements and advertisements. Page 2 was the editorial page. It contained the editorials and the more important news of the day. Page 3 was devoted to cable news from Europe and the United States all bearing on the Spanish-American War. 2007 Times Person of the Year On December 30, 2007, the Manila Times chose Reynado Puno as Times Person of the Year, chosen by all the newspaper's editors. Puno defeated second choices OFW, Governor Eddie Panlilio, the Filipino nurse, the DSWD social worker, the Pinoy farmer, Manny Pacquiao and Joey de Venecia. See also Libertito Palayo Filipino reporter Satter Ocampo References External links Official website